when you guys aren't going to be outing anybody in executive session, you're just discussing the protocol. Yeah. So wouldn't it be better for the for the public to know this instead of getting these interpretations by media people or by city council members? We would come out and and uh, why we go into executive session sometimes. I'm I'm relying on legal for that. That's our city attorney and and, and her recommendation. So we go in there. As far as I'm concerned, you can. You could air it out in public, and, and it should have been aired out uh, afterwards. But the bottom line is uh, we're adhering to the legal advice of our city attorney, and that's what she's responsible for. But I don't have any problem with with uh, with the release of the statutes. It's public knowledge. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's not, we're not playing, uh, we're not hiding anything. The point was that we were told you cannot do it for privacy reasons, not for health HIPAA reasons. And... Um, and it doesn't preclude any business from wanting to disclose or from allowing them to disclose it publicly. Yeah, but yeah. we're we're just saying that the health department's not going to do that to Right. You. Well, neither are the businesses. No, I mean, you not. know, so many people have tried to get these uh, these uh, nursing facilities, you know, to, to be forthcoming. And, and they don't. They hide behind HIPAA. They hide behind any number of things because, you know, they don't want to tell everybody that there's, you know, 50 residents that have coronavirus right. and the only way they could have gotten them is from their employees because these people have been on lockdown you know from the word go right you know so that's not going to happen at at some point i think the biggest problem here is that as as not as somebody who sta- sits in front of a mic every day i think as somebody who has elderly parents who has a very large extended family who you know uh, who speaks for people who call me and stop me in stores all the time and say, guys, we need information. Mm-hmm. What well, could it pause, cause a panic? Yes, it's going to cause a panic. But I got to be honest with you, um, bashing around in the dark with no information yeah. is way Just more dangerous. I think because sure. you've got social media and yeah. all kinds of firestorm on there right now. So is it is it possible that maybe later today you you could have the city attorney release the statute that she's basing her decision on? I'm I'm happy to require that. I, that's fine with me. I've okay, never had any issues that. on that, and it was explained uh, uh, very clearly yesterday uh, to us. And and you know the fact that a couple of council members chose, uh, you know, Senator the late Senator Patrick Moynihan was famous for saying in a debate with someone, you know, you're entitled to your own opinion, you're not entitled to your own facts. <laughs> I've got, I agree. Uh, yeah. I've got, uh, I've got some council members who believe they're entitled to their own opinion and yeah. their own facts. So, <laughs> okay, can, but see, yeah. that's the reason why when you guys get told, "Hey, let's go into executive session," if you can't see a reason for it, then stand up for your constituents and right. say, "Yo, we need to. We're yeah. not. We're not going to be outing anybody here. Mm-hmm. We're not going to be releasing any yeah. information. We're discussing pro- process and protocol." Or and that back, should be done in public. Or come back from the from the executive session and explain to us what just happened. In case, you know, somebody yeah. slips up and does mention a name or two, then that stuff could be edited before when you do this after the fact. Sure. It's just, I don't it's have just any been... problem with the transparency and the clarity for information like this whatsoever. Now, you can get into okay. personnel issues or real estate issues or things like that from an economic development standpoint that can't be disclosed. But I don't have any problem with this being disclosed and frankly uh um if council members were um, honest they would say that as well okay okay well then okay as you because you don't get a vote unless there is a tie vote so you're kind of the dad you're kind of the you're the mediator and so the next time somebody wants to go into executive session then I, I need I need you as our mayor to speak mm-hmm. up and say why are we going into ex- executive session? Yes. Should we be going into executive session? And then if you do, come back out and say, okay, here's what was said. Right. We're not going to be outing anybody. We're not going to be releasing that kind of. Inf- here's why. Yeah. Here's why. And I, here's the statute. I think I said some of that yesterday. As I recall, I came out and said. <clears throat> 